King of the Road. It's the King of the Road Show, and I'm your host, Jim King. Proud to report that I'm finally sitting high atop my genuine hand-carved solid mahogany Lion's King throne. I specially ordered it from Finders Keepers located at 5550 East Tex Freeway in Beaumont next to Target. In addition to being a place to order royal furniture like my brand new throne, Finders Keepers is the only consignment shop in the area. Let Finders Keepers sell your furniture. Stop in there today or call 409-347-0066 and tell them King of the Road sent you. Now for this week's show. Later in the half hour, we'll be cruising to the renowned Texas Renaissance Festival located between Magnolia and Plantersville, 45 minutes uh, northwest of Houston. By the way, this year's festivities will wrap up on Sunday, November 29th. Stay with me and we'll check out the Texas Renaissance Festival. First, we'll air our exclusive concert footage and interview with singer-songwriter Stoney LaRue. Stoney LaRue was born in Taft, Texas, raised in southeastern Oklahoma, and began playing country music while a teenager. He wound up in Stillwater, Oklahoma, a town famous for a long line of red dirt artists like uh, Cross Canadian Ragweed, Jason Bullen, Mike McClure, No Justice, and of course, Stoney LaRue. Ride shotgun with me and hold on tight as we cruise to the Dixie Dance Hall in downtown Beaumont to check out Stoney LaRue. One man has the power to take you behind the scenes. Jim King of the Road. Jim King of the Road. What have you say? Tell me what have you say? What have you to say now? very much. Wonderful to be here with you all this evening. How's everything going? Good, good. How's the kids? Good, good. This is some of the new stuff here, y'all. On your toes, you move so fast and go so slow. Every day is a brand new day. But you know the main things, they remain the same. Oh, you know the children need, they need a helping hand. still needs is needs the sun and rain and you know the main things they remain the same times have changed but not that much man still needs his woman's touch Stoney LaRue man what's up brother great to see you again nice to see you too I think the first time I met you was over at uh, like I said Wild Bill's yeah a few years ago but here you're the Dixie Dance Hall tonight, and uh, you're one of those troubadours that just keeps a, a 
busy schedule. You Very would, busy. Yeah, guys like you and um, Wade Bowen, who we recently on the show, mm -hmm. uh, Randy Rogers Band, uh, Cody Canada, and the uh, Cross Canadian Ragweed. Those are all your your brothers, so to speak. Aren't Compadres, they? definitely. Yeah. You know, we do the same thing, so it's good to talk to people who are in the similar occupation. Yeah. Tell me um, what the difference between uh, red dirt music, uh, the genre, and uh, Texas country, because I'm kind of curious. To, there, there really isn't that much difference, is there? It doesn't seem to be. I mean, I, I think Texas is a lot more country driven, you know, as uh -huh. far as the genre. And uh, Red Dirt is a little bit more open with the, uh, with the styles. And uh, I don't guess it can really encapsulate an entire genre. It just kind of talks about more of a culture and the type of song that you're writing, like uh, Fit Delivers Honesty. And, mm -hmm. you know, and through what means, I think, is inconsequential. Uh, Texas music is more country based, and Red Dirt is just whatever you want to throw out there, but it, it all seems to be accepted in the same circles. You notice that? Yeah. It's the King of the Road Show, and we're checking out Stoney LaRue's recent concert at the Dixie Dance Hall in downtown Beaumont. More in a moment. And coming up later, we'll cruise to the Texas Renaissance Festival near Plantersville. 